Have you ever wondered what separates the financially stable from those living paycheck to paycheck? It's a question that hovers in the back of our minds, a puzzle we're all trying to solve. The answer, financial stability, is not about having a hefty paycheck. It's about creating wealth and managing it effectively. We often equate wealth with a high income, but that's a common misconception. It's your boy here to give you faceless, valuable commentary today. Pay attention on God. Many high earners are just as financially precarious as those earning less. Why? Because wealth isn't about how much money you make, it's about what you do with it. It's about making your money work for you, not the other way around. Wealth creation is a process. It requires planning, discipline, and a little bit of savvy. It's about understanding the power of investing, the importance of savings, and the magic of compound interest. It's about diversifying your income, not putting all your eggs in one basket. The secret lies not in the amount of money you make, but in how you distribute your income. The key to long-term financial stability is income diversification. This isn't about putting all your eggs into one basket, but rather scattering them in various spots to increase your chances of success. Now, you might be wondering, what exactly is income diversification? Well, in the simplest terms, it's the practice of having multiple income streams as opposed to relying on a single source. Imagine a stool. A stool with one leg cannot stand, but add more legs and it becomes more stable. Similarly, if you depend solely on one income stream, say, your full-time job, you're like a one-legged stool. Any change or disruption in that single source can significantly impact your financial stability. But if you have multiple income streams, you're more like a stool with several legs, far more resilient and stable. Now, why is income diversification important? Well, for starters, it's a fantastic risk management strategy. Let's say your main source of income takes a hit or even disappears entirely. If that's your only income, you're in trouble. But if you've diversified, you have other sources to lean on. It's like having multiple parachutes. If one fails, you've got others to keep you afloat. Additionally, income diversification can actually increase your total income. It's not just about safety, it's about growth too. Whether it's a side business, investments, rental income, or freelance work, these additional streams can significantly boost your overall earnings over time. But it's crucial to remember, this isn't a get-rich-quick scheme. It's a long-term strategy. It requires planning, time, and sometimes a bit of trial and error. But the potential benefits far outweigh the initial effort. So, to wrap up, income diversification isn't just about earning more. It's about a lot more than that. It's about creating a safety net for your financial future, managing risks, and potentially boosting your income. It's about giving yourself the power to thrive, not just survive, in the face of financial uncertainty. Income diversification is not just about earning more, it's about creating a safety net for your financial future. So how can you diversify your income? This question often floats around the minds of those seeking financial independence. The answer is not a one-size-fits-all, but there are several methods worth considering. The stock market is a classic route. By investing in a variety of companies, industries, and regions, you can spread your risk and potentially reap rewards when markets are buoyant. There's also the option of bonds. They're essentially loans you give to companies or governments who pay you back with interest over a set period. Bonds are generally considered safer than stocks, but the returns are usually lower. Real estate is another viable avenue for income diversification. Buying property to rent out can provide a steady stream of income, and over time, property values can increase, leading to potential profit up on sale. However, bear in mind that this method requires a significant upfront investment and ongoing management. Mutual funds are an excellent option for those who prefer to leave the hard work to the professionals. These funds pool money from multiple investors to buy a diverse mix of stocks, bonds, or other assets. They offer instant diversification and are managed by experienced fund managers. 
But let's not forget about the concept of passive income. This is money that you earn with little to no daily effort, creating an income stream that can grow over time. Rental properties can fall into this category once they're up and running, but there are other options too. Online businesses, for example, can generate passive income. You could start a blog, develop an e-commerce store, or create digital products to sell. Of course, these methods are not without their risks. The stock market can be volatile, real estate can be affected by market downturns, and online businesses can face stiff competition. But that's where the beauty of diversification comes in. By spreading your investments across different income streams, you reduce the impact if one area performs poorly. Remember, each income stream comes with its own set of risks and rewards. The goal is to balance them for a steady cash flow. Diversification isn't about putting all your eggs in one basket. It's about spreading them out to capture opportunities wherever they may arise. Let's look at an example of how income diversification works. Imagine, if you will, a savvy investor named Alex. Alex isn't a billionaire or even a millionaire. Yet, he's managed to create a robust financial safety net for himself. How? Through income diversification. Alex works a regular 9 to 5 job as a software engineer. He has a decent salary, but he doesn't stop there. He's also a part-time real estate investor. He owns a couple of rental properties that bring in steady monthly income. But that's not all. Alex has also invested in a diversified stock portfolio, which has a mix of high-risk, high-return stocks, and some safer, steady-growing ones. These investments provide him with dividends and potential capital appreciation. Additionally, Alex has a side hustle. He's a talented programmer and develops mobile applications in his spare time. Some of these apps have even become popular, providing him with regular royalties. Each of these income streams might not be huge on their own, but together, they add up to a significant amount. Now, let's play out a hypothetical situation. Suppose Alex loses his job. It's a setback, but not a catastrophe. Why? Because Alex still has income from his rental properties, his stock investments, and his app royalties. He's not reliant on a single source of income. His diversification strategy has provided him with a financial cushion. Over time, these diversified income streams compound. Each source of income grows at its own pace, and together they contribute to Alex's growing wealth. It's like a snowball rolling down a hill, gathering size and speed. The more diversified the income, the bigger and faster the snowball. This is the power of income diversification in action. It's not about getting rich quick, it's about building long-term wealth and financial stability. It's about creating a safety net that allows you to weather life's financial storms and come out on the other side, still standing. As you can see, diversifying your income can significantly improve your financial stability. It's a strategy that works for Alex, and it can work for you too. Let's recap the key points we've covered today. Understanding the importance of income diversification is the first step towards financial stability. It's not just about having multiple sources of income, but rather, it's about creating a well-rounded portfolio that can withstand economic downturns and market volatility. Income diversification is akin to a safety net, ensuring you're not overly reliant on one income source. It's about spreading risk across different income streams, much like an investor diversifies their portfolio across different asset classes. This way, if one income stream dries up, you have others to fall back on. We've discussed several methods to achieve income diversification. These include investments in stocks, bonds, real estate, and mutual funds. Each of these options has its own set of risks and rewards, so it's crucial to do your research and perhaps even consult with a financial advisor. But it's not just about investment. There are other ways to diversify your income, such as starting a side business, freelancing, or even turning a hobby into a source of income. Remember, the key is to find multiple income streams that work best for you. The benefits of income diversification are plentiful. 
It not only provides additional financial security, but also opens up opportunities for wealth creation. It allows you to take calculated risks with some of your income streams while keeping others safe and steady. Moreover, income diversification can lead to financial freedom. It can provide the means to retire early, travel the world, or achieve other personal goals without the stress of living paycheck to paycheck. On God, I appreciate you for still watching to this point. So, start thinking about how you can diversify your own income. Click the next video popping up. Consider your skills, interests, and financial goals. Explore different investment options. Start a side hustle or turn a passion into a profit. The possibilities are endless. Remember, the journey to financial stability starts with a single step. Start diversifying your income today for a more secure tomorrow. My G on my soul.